In the first step, we need to select the settings. So once we are here, we need to choose the network option and then go for the connection status. Now go down to view PlayStation network status, select it and make sure all the green circles here. If not, what you have to do is simply just go back to the main settings, then go for the users and accounts, go down to other option, then select restore licenses. Now check all the games and apps from here and then select the restore option. Now wait for a few seconds to complete the process and once done, go back to the main settings. Now go back to the network, select settings and on the right side choose setup internet connection. Then press this button from your controller that is option button on your in connection and then select frequency and choose automatic for it. Then select the first option that is advanced settings. Now once we are here we need to select the DNS settings to the manual to access the primary DNS and secondary DNS. For the primary DNS add 8888 and for the secondary DNS add 8.8.4.4. Once done, select OK, wait for a few seconds to complete the reconnection process and then simply restart your PS5. That's it guys, you're good to go.